What would you do if a simple ER visit turned into a life-altering diagnosis? That's exactly what happened to one Utah mother of two, and her heartbreaking story is capturing the hearts of people everywhere. Today, we're diving into the emotional journey of Erica Diarcar, a 33-year-old single mother now planning her own funeral. Erica walked into the emergency room with what she thought was just a shoulder injury. But her life took a devastating turn when doctors diagnosed her with an aggressive form of small cell lung carcinoma. That diagnosis, at just 30 years old, has completely changed the course of her life, and her children's too. Erica is a mom to two young kids, 5-year-old Ilya and 7-year-old Jeremiah. You can imagine how tough it was for her to hear that multiple metastasized tumors had already spread throughout her body. As she puts it, the damage had already been done. And to make things even harder, she received this devastating news just one day before Mother's Day in 2022. But that wasn't all. Earlier this year, in January, Erica was also diagnosed with Cushing syndrome, a condition that drastically impacted her health. She gained over 60 pounds in a matter of weeks and started experiencing severe muscle and bone deterioration, high blood pressure, and type 2 diabetes. The syndrome even made it difficult for her to walk, further complicating her already fragile situation. Despite these overwhelming health issues, Erica kept working full-time for as long as she could, taking only brief breaks for her cancer treatments, surgeries, and radiation therapy. It wasn't until her physical condition became impossible to hide that she finally shared her story with the world. On her GoFundMe page, she wrote, I have been ashamed and embarrassed for people to know the truth, but the physical effects are starting to take control, and I can't hide it any longer. Sadly, her treatments stopped in September when they were no longer effective. That's when doctors gave Erica the most heartbreaking news of all, she only had three months to live. In her words, three months to spend with my babies and loved ones. Three months to make the best of what time I have left. Now, Erica is focused on spending every moment she can with her children, putting all of her energy into making sure they have lasting memories together. Erica has also had to face the unimaginable task of planning her own funeral. She launched a fundraiser with the hope of raising $5,000 to cover funeral expenses and help support her kids after she's gone. But in a heartwarming turn, her story touched so many people that the fundraiser has now surpassed $750,000. The extra funds will be placed in a trust for her children, ensuring they'll be taken care of in the future. Her cousin, Angelique Rivera, shared a touching photo of Erica's children hugging their mother in a hospital bed, a photo that quickly went viral, inspiring offers of support from people across the country. Strangers are offering meals, Halloween costumes for the kids, toys, and so much more, showing just how much Erica's story has moved them. Erica's gratitude is clear. She thanks everyone for their support and is especially thankful to her medical team in Ogden for their care. As she put it, my children are my whole life, light, and soul. They are my fight and what keep me going. As for the kids, they're hoping to spend another Christmas with their mom. They're even planning a family camping trip, determined to make the most of the time they have left together. And that's where Erica's journey stands today, focusing on making every moment count with her children. Our thoughts are with Erica and her family during this incredibly difficult time. That's a wrap for today's video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. You're watching AU News.